Hello and welcome to the crap Euros for this game between Montenegro and Latvia. Latvia scraping through with that dramatic 3-1 win over Estonia, while Montenegro got three, two 3-0 three wins to end the group and go through as group winners. James Carter joined by Jack Shepard. What are we making of this game? Uh, well, I think Latvia will struggle. We saw in the last game that... Uh, they finished second in their group with Moldova, and Moldova did kind of take a bit of a bit of a battering. It wasn't so much of a battering, but no, they it struggled. Wasn't, but uh, yeah, they struggled. And if Latvia struggled in that group to even get through, I think the team who finished top of the other group is going to absolutely humiliate Latvia yes. here. Well, but... I, I feel like um, Montenegro only getting stronger as the group goes on. Yes. Um, no stopping of it, so yeah, it will be a very tough ask for Latvia, but they are the last surviving of the Baltic nations. Yeah, Jovetic has, has found his feet, his striking boots have been laced well and truly up, and uh, not much seems to stop him at the minute. We can see how this fixture goes. Lovely sunny day in Moldova, the hosts are out though, so it's not sunny for the fans. Montenegro no, in the not red. So much. Latvia in the white with the burgundy shorts. Here's Vuskovic. Marusic on the holding midfield role kind of thing. Bol Boljevic plays through to Tomasovic, but that is cleaned up by Os, the centre back. Salonyek. Very little nice. salon yet, looks almost like a toddler out there. Uh, well, I don't... Offside. Thanks to the angle. That's some angle for a human to be at. Yeah, but wasn't it originally touched by the, the defender there? I think... I think oh, that right. is correct, sir, because he did interfere with play. But not okay. Sure. Just got a toe on that, but not enough to divert it from its path. No. It is one. Oh, and he swung at that, but it, it hit the air. That was a vital touch. They haven't conceded a goal yet, Montenegro. Did I say that? You might have said that. Mm. Getting a bit of uh, early onset there. Well, that is, uh, that's the work of Sergei Savic, isn't it? Savic, uh, Stefan Savic. Stefan Sergei, same, same name. <laughs> oh, Lovitch couldn't get there. Took away. Great stuff from the number took three. Away by the... Yeah. What? Oh apparently. no, apparently Lovitch just apparently missed. Not. Okay. I think Sergei is a better name for Savic actually. I think you should rename him. <laughs> He's actually known as Sergei. What will happen here? Savon has been good. Probably one of the brightest sparks for Latvia. But can't do it all himself. Just can't seem to break out of that kind of field area. And that must be offside. Ooh, oh, he missed, he's so missed. it doesn't matter. Ooh, well, the referee was not forthcoming with a flag. Oh, the assistant wasn't far from him with a flag there. Beautifully chipped off, didn't be the pass of him. All he had to do was find the finish. Exit wide. Could be costly that. One and then go copy a costly miss. Uh, Gabovs. Raisins. Aldrich is with a nice little turn there. Still has the ball at his feet. Hits that at the defender. Good whip in. Aldrich is. Gets a bit firmly tackled there, but the referee doesn't think about it. Aldrich is again. Tries to do a nice turn. Seems to be his, the only trick in his locker, that. He's turning on the spot. Yes. Jankovic. Took it oh, away. Oh, in the lead. Oh, Latvia. 
can't seem to get past the defender there. Need a celebration. And uh, well, Latvia carve through, and Montenegro will have the lead. Bakic's lovely white boots there. And only took one sweeping ball forward. Side? Lovely tucked away, know. but I thought that was offside. Oh well. Referee's already showing his There was somebody on the far hand side playing him on side. Certainly was a close one and uh, took it quickly past the keeper. 1 0. And a goal scored by Montenegro that wasn't Jovetic. Yes. Three goal scorers now in the tournament. On Tuzan's Uldrekis. Savon the X. Got some space. Hits one. Oh. Unbelievably close. It was. Just didn't. Didn't go where you wanted it to. Just now on his eyes. Good connection on the ball. Good, 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 good power. But it was just off task. Just lacked the placement. Maybe, maybe that's the problem. We hit it a bit too hard, and it. He hit it too accuracy. true, as they would say. I don't know. Anyway. Petkovic. Ump the one. Jovetic did well there. Good hold up play. And here's Marusic. Oh. Jankovic. Oh, Valens is... wants to make the stop. What a oh, header from the middle man. Oh, the goal to and Jan where's Jankovic come from? I've never heard of this guy. Well, I've maybe just not noticed him because he's first two goals he scored in the quarter final. Come alive in the knockout rounds. And Latvia, oh well, he did what he needed to do, just pass us poor. Good work from the number well, two though. Well worked from the number two, yes, you're right. Lovely little chip as well, wasn't it? Just over that first defender. I mean, suppose it didn't go over him, it just kind of missed him. But well, Jankovic had the had the desire to get to there before the defender and yeah, hit the back of the net. I think this is going pretty much as we predicted, James. One of the first ties that has. Oh, just couldn't get it away there. And still, Montenegro have not conceded a goal. Because they have these defenders who can do them sort of things, who can, who are just alive to the ball a bit more than other nations. And as long as they've got that, they've almost got a chance of winning this tournament. Jankovic on a hat trick here. Jankovic. And he scored oh, it. Oh, beautiful finish. They can't deal with him, Latvia. <laughs> yeah, you're right, James. He's come from absolutely nowhere. What, a hat trick in the quarter final? How's that happen? I don't know. Great finish. Near post. Really far for the there. Latvians here. Good ball, lad, as well, from the holding mid. Good dribbling. Could Valkins have done better here? Near post, he's been beaten at. Uh, no, no, I'm not saying that. That's pace nope. and power. Okay. That's a true shot, that. How <laughs> can... No, he's, he made a couple of decent stops here. He's 40 years old, for goodness sake. He's not an agile young man anymore. He's, he's not an agile young man. He shouldn't be playing in goal. Well, he's better than the other agile. He's, yeah, but it's a different type of kind of goal here, isn't it? <laughs> Oh! Crowd calling for a red there. And I don't blame them. The yellow? Yellow yes. card, okay. It was filthy that though. No. Oh. Wow. 
off the ball, try to injure him. Should be a red. Referee's been too lenient there. They love being lenient, these referees. They love it. Pooley given away. Well run back by Lazans. On to Zunas. He's absolutely knackered out there. Paggered, you could say. Maybe. Kicked in the face there. Referee doesn't care. Lays hands. Savonieks. Good touch. Good shot. Oh, oh. Just, just. He's had two good chances. Is it the same man who got the other chance? Yes, he could have scored I two there. Going, it, it's a different game, but. Uh, a matter of. I don't even think inches. A matter of centimetres, that one. My word, Latvia. Well, they're 3 0 down. And, uh, well, it's been a one man show, really, hasn't it, from Montenegro? Proving Jankovic. that they've got more than Jovetic, which obviously gives them confidence going in to what you would imagine being a semi final now. Yeah, it looks like. Oh, my throat there. It looks like they're going into a semi final and thus making it into the crap World Cup in a few years' time. Yes, yes, that looks, that looks likely, yes. Latvia, of course, already there as yes. a host. So there's no nothing riding on it in terms of that. It's just this tournament riding on it for for, for Latvia. But uh, yeah, they, so, they've had three shots, one on target, uh, versus Montenegro, five, four on target. But they're all been good goals. Savonyx near miss could be a different game if this goes in. So close. That's nestling the one, isn't it? Really nestling in the bottom corner. And then. Uh, there's a bit of a quick strike from Montenegro to go into a 3 0 lead. Well worked from Stojkovic to give Jankovic a header. With the second goal of his day. And then Jankovic just does it himself for the third. Picks it up midfield and blasts it past the old and decrepit goalkeeper. Yes. <laughs> yes. This last tournament, you would imagine, maybe. Unless he wants to carry on until the crap will cop. And his call. The... Oh, that was so close, that Sav on the X1, right at the end there. So it is 3 0, but uh, I think it's a little bit closer than 3 0 would suggest. I think that Montenegro are deservedly leading, though. But I think we've seen the quality in this side. It's going to be an interesting tie if they meet Azerbaijan. I'm not even or sure. when they meet Azerbaijan, Azerbaijan, should we say. Ryan Latvia scored three in the second half last time, didn't they? Well, yeah, you, you never know what's going to happen. Against a weaker side, of course. A much weaker side in Estonia. Rackles will be coming on, though. They've changed it from Aldrichs. Aldrichis, sorry. Didn't have time to make a substitution there, <laughs> did uh, Montenegro. Rackles, a former Reading man, is on the field now. Start the second half. Hits it from long range. Well, symbol for Pektovic. He's going to take all the time in the world he can with this one. Maruzic. Well dealt with by Gabbard. What do you do now? Ikauni X, looking for a pass. Doesn't find a single soul. I think he was expecting the ball to arrive to him before it even had. The, uh, the winger there. Oh, <laughs> double push, push simply. Yep. He's not a small man either. That was some strength on display there. Like two rhinos clashing. <laughs> In the Serengeti. Uh, oh, well, it will be won by Ovetic. Oh, great save from Van Inns. Very agile for the, for the veteran there. Oh, just can't send a... 
So here is Boljevic to Bakic. Marusic tries to find Jovetic in the middle. He's got a lot of work to do from there, though, Jovetic. Good block, that. You'd get a shot away. Will turn out for a corner kick to Montenegro. They just have too much for the Latvians, I feel, this Montenegro side. Jovetic looking a bit frustrated there. <laughs> Even though they're enough, he's not getting the goals. He wants no, the glory. Savoniex hits it in. Um, it's in! Oh, and it's four. another one! It's his four! Is it his four? Yes! Oh no, where, where is Jankovic come from? He's going to take the golden boot from this game. <sighs> well, he's put himself in contention. Let's see what happens here. Oh, that terrible goalie in. Goalie in? Yep, terrible goalie in. And the back post, that's the first time we've seen a goal going from the back post, I think. Yes. Jankovic, wow. What an absolute game he's had. Buskovic. Boljevic. Simply oh. done. This Latvia team is all today. Defending wise, they can't do it. I think they've been like that the whole tournament, if I'm honest with you. It's just. It's just getting victories. It's getting ruthlessly exposed. That's the first kind of hammering we've seen in a while, this one. Yes. Unpleasant. Just for it to happen in the quarter final. Is this Montenegro team. Well, I would be shocked if this team doesn't win the tournament. <laughs> How lucky were Latvia to get through to the quarter finals? It was a freak of a game that they managed to get through on. Well, it was a. It was the determination and will of the Latvian team in that game. And they've got none of it's that been day. ebbed out. Well, yes. <laughs> it's been a seat down of them. Just so slightly. Through the course of this game. Everything, say, everything they seem to do is... Uh, I mean, he's not, he just doesn't have the pace or the <laughs> strength. Well, he does win a corner, but I don't know how. That was ever so simply dealt with. There will be nicked away from them. Well, he doesn't even have the strength to get there. Terrible touch. Well, he's never going to get beaten there. Well, it le he nearly did. He was so close to Jovic getting there first. Oh, my word. It's all right. I think he got there, though. He did, eventually. Both, both players stumbled about 20 yards away from the ball, and there was no one else there. Oh, clear the way. Never like to see a game that's not particularly competitive. But I do think this... Uh, that, that's a Bajan a match for them. We saw that in an ill-nil draw, didn't we? That's a cracking time we've got on our hands there. Tomorrow, though, that could even be uglier than this. Kazakhstan and San Marino meeting up. Oh, God. I know. That quality of uh, Kazakhstan. That offside? Might be a free kick. Will it be offside? I'm not sure, James. What will the referee do? Is it maybe a foul here? Yes. Uh, Lift the leg. Just, that's just yes. What will happen here? Ten minutes left. So Jankovic is going to take this one. Hasn't scored enough today. <laughs> Run in to the play.
Good block. Is it going to go up for a corner? No, he saves it. <laughs> Into the hands of Vannings. Bumped up for Rackles. Saganic. First time I think he's touched the ball. Well, that just summarises it all. Comes back Offside from offside there, Jovicic. Oh, surprisingly, how on earth have Latvia lost 5 0 here and Jovicic hasn't even scored a goal? Yeah. Maybe oh, they've been covering good. Jovicic, man marking him, and that's left the other fella, yes, his name as maybe. Jankovic. Is that just going to be a straight goal kick? Yep, yeah, that went through. Do you think anyone? Mohammed forwards. Boom. Yes. Left someone out in the crowd, that one. Pick out his man. Some unsuspecting. Good stuff here from Latvia. Nope. Oh, I Oh, surely the referee has a little bit of That's it. pity and he will, he'll call a halt to this match. Latvia lose 5-0 to Ruthless Jankovic. Well, let's see. It was Jankovic who was played in originally, missed that early chance. Mm, could have been five for him. Could have been. And then they did get the goal. It took 25 minutes to get that opening goal. Marko Jankovic is his name. Plays for Crotone on loan from Spal. Oh, well, there you go. He plays in Italy, and that's quite good. And only 24. Plenty of years ahead of him. Oh, that was another goal. The goals just kept coming, didn't they? And then this, he just has the space and the freedom. Makes the most of it. Do you worry that the golden boot's going to end on five goals with a massive draw like this, James? Could, but could do. No, I, I believe have... one of these one of these players will get a, a vital goal. Well, there's only Shudai and Jovetic in the semi-final on, on this list, isn't there? Up to now... Oh, there's, there's due respect for Kazakhstan, yeah, but Damascan's out and Golubikas is out. Okay. We'll see. And they're still. Well, part. if uh, Jankovic turns up again. Oh, and Soteriu's out, isn't he? Oh no, Cyprus are Cyprus are playing, aren't they, on Saturday? Yes, they are. Okay, so there's another one there, Sot Soteriu. They just came to exploit the gaps in the. Latvian defence. <laughs> well, Simple stuff there. Out. Latvia brushed All aside. Yes, simply brushed aside. 8.5 for Jankovic. What, what, what does it take to get a 10 in this game? I don't know. Four goals. But the rest of his team are only rated sixes and one seven. Really, what's the star of this game, wasn't he? Yeah. Interesting stuff. Well, tomorrow, do you think we'll see another kind of thrashing tomorrow, Kazakhstan, San Marino? <laughs> Unfortunately. I'm not out hope for the, the Unfortunately, I think we could have an even worse result here. But... <laughs> uh, not a great uh, advert for crap football. Well, y yes. Well, it depends what kind of football you enjoy. I mean, some people enjoy kind of lots of goals to one side, but we'll see. Well, at least we've got a decent game on Saturday, quite a close affair. Yes, that should be should be a cracker. Um, yeah, I'll say Latvia, of course, 
we won't see them now until they're in the hosting the crap World Cup. Do you think they've done enough to kind of suggest they can do reasonably well in that tournament? So that will change a bit in that. I don't clear think so. Term. I don't think they can do anything no, I'm, I'm, really. I'm, maybe they can take on the spirit of the nation, but I'm I'm kind of looking at it and I'm kind of condemning the three Baltic side. I don't think they've shown their best side at this tournament. They've got to out of the. The, the thing is, they've there's three Baltic nations, so the, it triples the chance of the home nation winning, but it's still quite a small chance. Well, the way I would view it is, they have played. I mean, Montenegro are one of the favourites this time. If they come, they now if they secure their place in the Crap World Cup, which they have, they'll probably be coming in that Crap World Cup as one of the favourites. You would imagine. Who? Montenegro. Uh, yeah. Well, yes. Probably. And Azerbaijan probably will be as well, so... And Kazakhstan. And Kazakhstan. If and you've got your, your Asian up. nations who do quite well. Could be a wild card from the Oceania region. Who knows? Yeah, to, yeah there's normally a lot more quality in the crap World Cup. So uh might struggle very much there, Baltic nations. We'll see. They, won't won't all... be any San Marinos there, that's for sure. Unless they win tomorrow somehow. Won't be any whipping boys. Won't be any Armenias. Hello. No. Won't be any Andorras. Won't be any Liechtensteins or Faroe Islands. No whipping boys for Latvia to get a result against. No, but maybe will a whipping boy come from North America? Well, the likes of the uh, likes of Jan Guir or some some side like that. Who knows? Well, who knows? Yes, only time will tell, and I can't wait for the tournament. Well, but we've just got to finish this one. Yes, and we've got an Asian crap coming up and a crapper America, so plenty of craps coming up. And we'll see you tomorrow, same time, 4 o'clock, on Twitch. See you later. Bye-bye.